This study demonstrates a fracture of the spinous process of C2 following a car crash. This injury was missed on plain films. This study shows five breaks in wires from a previous fusion surgery following a low-speed crash. These wires were 300-pound test titanium steel, and the orthopedist was extremely surprised that a low-speed crash caused this extent of damage to his fusion. Notice how the movement of the wire is different each time he flexes and extends. Abnormal motion is not always consistent. That's why we take multiple views of each abnormal segment. These two studies demonstrate what a broken odontoid process looks like in motion. Both of these patients were released from the hospital following low-speed crashes with negative plain film findings. Trusting an emergency room diagnosis may lead to your worst nightmare. Be sure to fully evaluate cervical spine injuries prior to treating them. An avulsion fracture of the elbow with a joint mouse that disappears into the joint on extension was missed until a digital motion x-ray was performed. Following a simple surgical procedure, the patient can now fully extend his arm without pain. This old navicular fracture demonstrated to be unstable when examined during active lateral flexion with a digital motion x-ray. This patient has experienced pain ever since a car crash where he was holding onto the steering wheel.